escape in progress. Oh my god! Oh my god. Is there anybody around here? Oh my god. We hit the jackpot. Oh, oh my god, let's take a look at this. We got and you lack batteries. Oh my, oh my god. god! You know how much these are? They're worth a fortune. <laughs> yeah. You sure there's nobody around? I think we're out of danger. Okay. Okay. Oh, look. We'll look at this one here too. Device, you know what you can do with this? Everything. Everything. It's beyond radioactive. Oh my god. Spend so much money on the black market. And this one? Well, this is just if somebody makes really, really angry. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna blow this. We're gonna have some fun with this too. Okay. So I just oh my god. I forgot. We got a show to do. We gotta we, we, we gotta get ready. We gotta get back and do it. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Before anything else bad happens. Oh, you got it. Let's do it. <laughs> Are you ready to take off? I'm so ready. Oh, this is going to be great. One, two, three. Oh my god, that was so awesome. It was amazing. We've got to do that more often. Definitely, but let's not get caught. Uh, no, definitely not, definitely not. Hey, <laughs> welcome back everybody to JW Statues. I'm Jason. And I'm Victoria Wilkinson. Let's talk about Groot first. He's on his own planet, minding his own business, you know, going for his daily walk, and he sees other fellow Groots beating up this poor defenseless maintenance mammal. So what does he do? He goes and he defends that mammal, but in the process, he kills another Groot. Well, he gets exiled from his planet. Why? Because he's got the biggest strawberry tart ever. You know, and, and it's somewhere in there underneath all that bark. He's a really, really good guy. So he gets sent to a Kree prison, and that's where he meets the temperamental genetic freak, Rocket Raccoon, <laughs> who's probably in there for the same thing. He was made by a bunch of scientists that poked and prodded him and did all kinds of ungodly things. I mean, wouldn't you be mad if you were taken away from your family? Of course, like who wouldn't? Exactly, yeah, and, and I can see why he's so upset. Well, anyways, they form their partnership there. They go on a bunch of journeys. They eventually get caught by the Nova Corps. They get sent to another prison, and that's where they meet the Guardians of the Galaxy. Drax, Gamora, Peter Quill. They manage to escape, and the rest is history. Now, I would like to get into the characteristics of these two cool dudes. Definitely. No, Groot. You can't. You'll die. Why are you doing this? Why? We are. The statue itself is made out of poly resin, and I think it's hand painted to perfection. What do you think, Sweetie? I think it is hand painted to perfection. Let's talk about Groot first. Yeah, let's do that. I love the colors that they used here. I could definitely see them, like the greens and the browns. Very, very nice. And take a look at all those vines, guys. They just go all the way up. And they go everywhere, from its head to its tree trunks. To its tree toes, yes, tree toes. all the way. And what do you think about, uh, I'm looking at his eyes right now. I think he's got a really cool gloss down. What do you think? Yeah, they're really glossy. And they have a lot of good detail too. They do, they do. I'm looking at his teeth right now. I think they did a pretty good job on that. Yeah, but they kind of look like popcorn. I'm not trying to hurt your feelings, if you're okay with that. I, I think he's okay. If anything, that's kind of making me hungry. I'd like to go get some caramel popcorn right now too. Well, you're not to get any right now. No, maybe maybe after the show, right? Yeah. And and also too, I really like what they did with Rocket. The sculpted fur is, is pretty nice. They did a good job it's with it. It's really good. It's perfect detail too. And did you see his backpack? I did. I I, I, I really like it. I don't know what that, that green button is for, but uh, I'm kind of curious. Oh. What, what do you what do you guys think it is? Uh, maybe y'all can help us out with that. Yeah, comment down below. What do you think it is? Also, too, they did a really really good job with his pants. Uh, it's very weathered. It looks really good. Um, also, too, uh, his blaster, his gun, 
I, yeah. I really like that as well. That's I'm, really cool. It looks really cool how it's kind of just, it's right over the twig. Yeah. It's just, it's just like, like resting right he, over it. Yeah. It's like he can get through any tough situation. He can just be like, <laughs> you, you bye bye. Like, nope, don't need you, don't need you. There you go, he's done. Exactly, they're the perfect duo. Yep. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> now, I think when we purchased this piece, we were looking for something along the lines of a good movie piece. I think this classifies as a good movie piece. I really think that the guys at Gentle Giant did a pretty good reproduction on it. What do you yes, think? I definitely agree with you. I'm glad you guys could stop by again today. Please subscribe and follow us at JW Statues on Instagram. And comment down below what you like about the statue or dislike. Thank you all for watching. Bye! See you guys later. Oh my god, are you, guys, are you ready to have some fun here? I, I, I think so. I mean, we got all the goods here. It's time to, time to party. I'm, I'm ready. Let's see. Which one are we going to get? Ooh, that's a good one. Hey, what is this doing now? Oh, it's a bomb.